In this tutorial, we will be covering the concept of absolute calibration. Now, spectral instruments imaging systems are absolutely calibrated. As a result, the numerical pixel values are related to a standard. And that standard is a physical measurement of the photons per second emitted from a pixel area that is the same for the standard and image. So for that reason, a measurement in radiance units has physical meaning and can be quantitatively compared to measurements made on any other absolutely calibrated instruments. More importantly, or more related to the example that we're showing today, is the measurements are independent of the instrument settings. So what we see here is three different images of the same five subjects or five mice. And as we can see, the signal is coming from the um, area of the brain of the mouse. The camera settings are different. More precisely, the binning is different. Binning eight, binning four, and binning two. But what's important here is that the ROIs, if we go from ROI one all the way through to ROI five, on all three images are essentially very similar. One could say, biologically speaking, they are the same value. Uh, 4.98 times 10 to the 6, for example, ROI1. ROI1 here is 4.89 times 10 to the 6. This demonstrates that even though we use different camera settings, we have the same photons per second. Now, this is important for users that are basically splitting the work of imaging the animals. One day, one person images the animals using certain camera settings, and day two, another tech or investigator uses different camera settings. That should not matter. That is okay. Also, over the course of a study, let's say eight-week study, on week one, your camera settings are going to be different than week eight. Say you have a xenograft model, you injected um, X number of cells. The first week, the signal is going to be most likely low. You might have to use longer exposure times, higher binning versus week eight, where your primary tumor is very intense, the signal is intense, and you might have to use very different camera settings, such as very short exposure times, lower binning. So for that reason, the instrument is absolutely calibrated and it gives you the luxury of using different camera settings without worrying about compromising your data.